Good evening, Mr. Chairman. His Excellency Nana Adudankwa Akufuado, the President of the Republic of Ghana. Honorable Chief of Staff, Akusuya Frema Osei Opari, Office of the President of Ghana. His Excellency D. Maxwell Sasa Kamaya, Foreign Affairs and Dean of Cabinet of Republic of Liberia. Dr. Ibrahim Zak, representative from Speaker of Parliament. Ministers, honorable members of parliament, members of the diplomatic corps, the clergy, Nime Name, the president of the GFA, Mr. Kurt Edwin Simon Okreku, and the executive of Ghana Football Association, presidents and past presidents of National Football Association, former football professionals, other sports officials and professionals, coaches, technical officials and footballers, my legend friends, distinguished ladies and gentlemen and all protocol observed. Mr. Chairman, I must confess that I didn't expect this level of appreciation when this idea was sold to me. I have always loved the quietness of my own small corner until it was revealed to me that my works could inspire the generation alive and unborn. It was suggested and agreed that my life through various stages ought to be documented into inspiring and beautiful masterpiece, legendary. But I'm overwhelmed by the love shown. What I see here this evening is an epitome of our country's appreciation for her men and women. I'm indeed proud of myself. I must commend the entire team behind this brilliant idea and wish to appreciate them for the hard work and sacrifice made to see this happen. My sincere gratitude also goes to the business community of Ghana for the warm reception and support accorded me when I knocked on their doors. The book details the intricate part of my life and career. It also talks about my amazing times with the senior national team, the Black Stars, and the success we have won together. Carefully worded and fact proved, the book is a clear recollection of every tournament I have been to. It is my hope that this book will enlighten future generations on what it has been. Mr. Chairman, let me repeat how honored I am to have you all here with me to celebrate the wonderful works of my life and career. Your presence, ladies and gentlemen, is indicative of the impact this blessed life of mine has made continue to make. I'm mostly assuredly to keep up the good work. This launch is just the beginning of many more, with plans of extending the launch to Kumasi. We also intend to have similar events in Dubai and the United Kingdom as well. This week, I went with my team to see His Royal Majesty, Otunfo Osetutu II, to officially seek his permission and inform him of our plans to launch the book in Kumasi in the Ashanti region. Mr. Chairman, before I end, I would like to call again for support for a project we intend to overtake. The goal is to distribute over 100,000 books to the youth of Africa. (laughs) 
we believe this initiative will go far. We believe this initiative will go a long way to help promising talents and open their minds and understanding. Last but not the least, I'd like to thank my friends, my legends, who came here to support me. My brother, Freedom, I call him Cheda, the maestro himself, Abedi Pele, Nime, thank you so much. Mr. President, thank you so much for honoring this great event. And the most important person in my life, who is not here with us, that's my mom. My dad is also around, who came here to support me. My friends and family, my brother, everybody who came here to support me, I thank you so much for what you have done. This is an historic event, and I promise to make Ghana proud. Thank you so much, and God bless you. Thank you.